Okay, so now we're going to find out a little bit about um, uh, corrective uh, facial blend shapes. Now, I don't really like using the, the word corrective blend shape because it's sort of used for other things. But in this case, really what we're talking about is combining a couple of blend shapes together and then having a, sculpt, uh, a sculpted fix for those two blend shapes. So it's probably a little bit easier to show this rather than to talk about it too much. <coughs> but basically, if we've got a, a, a frowny face here and a smiley face, oh sorry, that's not a frowny face, that's actually the pout and the smiley face. And then we're just gonna create a new blend shape here. So I'm gonna do this really simply, create blend shape. I'm just gonna, it's got a bit of a skin cluster on it too, but I'm just going to delete that by going select node and then hitting delete. So now we don't have any, uh, I'm gonna unlock that as well. Okay, so we've got uh, a blend shape here with a pout and with a smile. So uh, if we were to combine both of these, you can see that we get this sort of like straight line sort of face. And uh, that's kind of what you expect because you've got uh, a pout and a smile together. And uh, just say, for example, that we really wanted to use this and have a really lovely, nice sculpted shape at the end of this. Now, this is really common for a lot of face shapes. When you put two blend shapes together, they don't really work out and they're not nice uh, the way that you really want them. So a lot of times you want to come in and tweak these, these faces. So this is how to do it. So I'm just going to reset these to to those and this requires a script as well so what we're going to do is uh, run the script and this is uh, corrective blend shape is what it's called uh, I don't like to call it corrective blend shape but anyway uh, that's what the author has called it so let's edit this script and you can see that this is uh, a Python script corrective blend shape creator dot py it's a Python script and it's by this guy Carlos shaken L <coughs> so uh, if you do a Google search for that you can look it up and find it on his website now, uh, this has some very simple instructions. The first one is just to run the script. So let's run the script, uh, come up here. And uh, the first thing it says is here, uh, second, select in the following order, the master mesh, the first blend shape and the second blend shape. So we have the master mesh, which is our main mesh, the first blend shape and the second blend shape is the power because they're the ones we're talking about. <coughs> and then it says, uh, if we come along here, click the create blend shape button. So let's click the create blend shape button. Okay, so this is our uh, corrective blend shape that has added both of those two uh, faces together, just like we saw before. Now this is the face that we can now come in and sculpt. So I'm just gonna come in and fix this up a, uh, a little bit. Uh, just get it really, something really nice. So let's just take off the, the soft select come in here. I'm not going to spend a lot of time on this. Just something that looks pretty decent. We could come in here and we could sort of like just tighten some of those lines a little bit as well just to get something a little bit nicer. Of course you could do it up there too but just say I'm kind of happy with that face shape of those two uh, blended together. It's now a nice straight line. Now we follow the next instructions which says second click the connect blend shape to master button. So it's really pretty easy. I don't think you even have to select anything. We can just go connect blend shape to master. <coughs> and what that does is create another blend shape here. And this one, it's called, it's something different, mouth smile, mouth pout, dummy. So it's added the, the two, mouth smile and mouth pout together, and it's a dummy, which means it's really what I just did then is move those vertices around very slightly. And this is actually the offset <coughs> that uh, we've created. So this is the offset blend shape. And what the script automatically does is uh, writes a little tiny expression, which is really quite simple. <coughs> and if we open up our blend shape here, we can see that when the mouth pout is on, so let's go up here, and we have this new one, mouth smile, mouth pout, so that's our dummy one. Uh, as soon as these sort of combine together, and it's just a multiplication, so all the script is doing is saying one multiplied by mouth smile, 0.7 equals 0.7. 1 multiplied by 1 equals 1. And what you'll see is with that corrective little blend shape here, uh, it's actually fixed up our face shape so that's really nice and exactly the way that we wanted it here with this sculpt. So uh, let's just disconnect this expression if I can. Break the connection here. And uh, what you can see is if I 
take that back to zero, it's back to what we had before. So this is really nice because it's actually automatically uh, fixing that for us without us having to even do anything. So just to undo that a couple of times, <coughs> you can see what it is. Uh, there we go. Uh, it automatically comes on and off when those two add together. And it's really great. Now, just to know exactly what that's doing, we can open up our uh, expression editor up here. And uh, you can see our blend shape here with um, our different things. It's our dummy that the expression is on. And if we open it up, <coughs> It's a blend shape. Now you could do this with a multiply and divide node as well, but it's just done a little simple expression here, which is when the, <coughs> uh, the dummy, uh, that blend shape, which is that attribute right there, that's what that is, is that first line here. Uh, sorry, that one there equals, uh, so when it equals basically that attribute multiplied by the mouth pout, which is that line there is just simply mouth pout and that one is my mouth smile so it's just multiplying those two together to get the result so it's a lovely little simple script very easy to use uh, and it makes life a lot easier for corrective blend shapes